on the road to 17 and up. Another week, another challenge. This week, we travel on Thursday night prime time. We travel to L.A. Where the lights is bright. We took on Aaron Donald in the L.A. Rams. And I'm not going to lie. As we get closer to this perfect season, you got to reflect on the good and you got to reflect on the bad. The bad... We haven't had any tests. We've been steamrolling other than a couple games. But the good is that we're a primetime offense. You know, end of the year is almost here. So contract incentives are in motion. Like Taysom Hill. He need like two more touchdowns for another 500K. So what are we going to do today? We're going to get him a touchdown. All right, so we got the ball first. You know we got to come out here and make a statement. You know, I done changed the playbook around. I got some new plays. We're playing in the Rams Stadium. We got to make it look good. They start to drive on the ground. Come on. Now he is going to be stopped. All right, we just got to get a feel for this team. We haven't played them all year, so we got to see. You talk about this Rams defense. It's quite a unit, that's for sure. Number one in the NFL against the pass. And this is one of those something's got to give games. You got the number one passing team in the NFL against the number one defense against the pass. A lot of times, the battle's in the trenches. All right, there we go. There we go. We got Michael Thomas back. I forgot. He'd been injured for a minute. He's finally back. 14 yards is the pickup for so as you said you shrink the playbook pick all right we got album Kamara. let's see what this play can do i'm going to audible some things though coming off to the last game i want michael thomas on a zig guys have a little extra pep in their step and i want chris olave on a slant second and three and we'll hit Alave right there. I mean, we'll hit Mr. Thomas right there. It appears we've got a member of the Rams shaking up on that last play. Okay, so we do. We can hit. Okay, Alave has an option route because I want to zig him. But they, they're playing man, though. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to zig Olave because if he can beat him on man. Again, he'll drop the throw. I might run it in. I got room. I got room. Sometimes you just gotta do it yourself. The do it yourself kit. $9.99 at Walmart. The do it yourself kit. The DYI. And takes it into the end zone. You know, I might have to come out with a new product in the store. The NBA wall, do it yourself kit. I'm not going to be, I'm not going to tax y'all. It's only $10.99. You know, if you want to do it yourself, if you want to do something yourself, you can purchase it. I might put it on Amazon. I might put it on Amazon for you to purchase. They'll come out throwing here on first down, escaping the pressure right. You know I got that dead, I got that run and gun dead eye. So any throw that I throw on the run is going to be a perfect pass. This drive starting off on the right foot, 18 yards. You know that's the perfect, that's the perfect combo. I'm a scrambling quarterback, and I got perfect accuracy on the run. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it, eluding the pressure right, and he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. He'll wind up getting right about four there on the scramble, and it's second down. And that is his. All right, we're going to go. Ooh. They'll look to throw. Sliding. Ooh, that was close. I thought a sack was coming. But you see why I got that 98 speed. Before being taken down. You see why I upgraded my speed. 23. Now that's all about making something happen. No other attribute in the game could have got me out of that situation some time outside of the pocket waiting for someone to come open and when he did 
He put it on it for a big play and a first down. That speed is killer. And he's going to get this one down to the edge of the red zone. You know, I'm going to pitch it to Camara. Look at that good play. Look at that play. That option, I hit him with the pitch at the last second. And I got my running back in the end zone. Now out comes their leader and the captain of this offense back onto the field. Even if it's in the passing game, three catches a week ago, and he does a nice... All right, if, we, if it's there... I just want either Olave or Michael Thomas to get there and box them guys out. There we go. Just put your booty on them and box them out. Now you're getting the end zone. As a quarterback, as soon as you turn around, that ball should be coming to you. Charles, every time that he makes one of these plays, I, I think the front office, they get a big... That's just a possession catch. They feel more confident that they have found their guy, their future. Turn around, put your booty on him, and catch the ball. Obvious, he's a big That's easy money every time. This season, you're right. Especially when you got a prime time wide receiver. Their quarterback leading this offense back out. He threw a touchdown. We are looking good on Thursday night prime time. You know we on Amazon right now. You can buy the NBA Walt Do It Yourself kit while you're watching, watching the real product itself in real life, doing it itself. <laughs> oh, that's a pick. Oh, oh. Ah. Through the interception on the previous drive, but that only led to three points. Defense. I always end up throwing a pick. <laughs> but that never wavered my confidence. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive, he'll look to throw. That's complete to Malone, the tight end. You know, that never wavered my confidence, baby. You know, I'm always going to bounce back. The drive starting play, a good one. Give him 19. And that's a nice throw right there. And I'll tell you what I've seen in recent times and actually watched a presentation in the offseason from a college offensive coordinator that showed about 10 different drills that he runs with his quarterbacks. To and he's going to have to eat this one as down he goes. They'll wind up losing eight on the sack there. And it's second down. So that complicates things a bit here. 18 yards to go now on second down. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. There we go. We'll get 18 yards. We'll get it back. And we'll pick the first down up. Past midfield almost to the 40 before being before they could snap it. Yeah, you can take your time and use the clock and try and get set up. But once it gets near five seconds, that's when you often hear a quarterback yelling, hurry, hurry, to make sure everybody's ready to get the snap off. Okay, they're, they, they're, they're caught on because Kamara is covered this play. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Oh, in the bread basket. And he'll get this into the hands of Hill complete. And this is going to be another first down as the tackle is going to be made at the Rams 34 yard line. All right, this play was open last time. Alvin Kamara on the linebacker. He should get out there. To throw. He should get out there. That's ah. Incomplete. Oh, that's some good closing speed there defensively because that looked open for a minute. But that's great work with the ball. It was open. Never gave up. Converged on his man and broke the play up. They'll look to throw again. 
Flushed out right. This one complete to his running back, Jamal Williams. And he's able to get it down to the 25-yard line. And it appears we've got a member of the Rams shaken up on that last play. This will be play number eight here on the drive. It's third and a yard. Actually, I want Michael Thomas to do an in. No, I have him do a slant because that's not a. I wanted a deep end. Again, he'll drop to throw. All right, created that separation. There we go. And he will be brought down at about the six-yard line. Looking to speed things up here, going with some tempo. He'll drop to throw. Oh, I got room. Flush to his right. I got room. Ooh, I was trying to tippy toe. Inside the five at the four. He'll get three yards on the scramble there at second down. His running ability has been an extra dimension of their game plan thus far. For once, though, he doesn't create any. It gets harder and harder when you get closer to the goal line to throw the ball. You know I'm going for the pylon, baby. Why is he open? Why is Taysom, why is Taysom Hill open? It's an easy touchdown. It's an easy touchdown. I had to drop it in the bread basket. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. I just waited. I just waited. Then I had room to run. You know, I, I, I normally never sit in the pocket that long. But I just had to wait it out. Oh, he's open again. I didn't think he was going to be open. Play there for New Orleans. And even 40 yards. The chain gang hustling to catch up. Here's first and goal from just inside the 10. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. On the move to oh, they're just standing there. Chris Olave on a zig. Okay, that play did not work out how I thought it was. I thought they were in man. See, I didn't know. And ended up getting none because the quarterback had run an injury here. We got one of those big blockers in some discomfort. Always unfortunate to see an injury, especially this close to the end of the regular season. I had it. We'll step aside. I had that when I ain't gonna lie. Other direction as they come up now, third and long. All right, we're gonna try to get something. We're gonna try to pick up this first down. If not, we'll go about our business. Oh no! And that is incomplete. How about 
some applause for the defense there. They forced him to throw that one into coverage, and just like that, they're staring at a fourth down. Well done. We just got to get up out of here. Well, this was a fun one today. We out here trying to do too much. We just got to chill out. Offenses were clicking. Charles, these defenses, meanwhile, have a little something to clean up before their next contest. Yeah, neither end zone had a stop sign in it, did they? I mean, for both sides, visit it. And with frequency. Not fun to be a defensive player, but on the offensive side of the ball, those guys had a blast. One a wise man once told me, there's going to be three things in life that's always guaranteed. Death, taxes, and the three ball. As you know the old saying, you live by the three, you die by the three. Everybody loves a good old-fashioned head tap, a slam dunk. The old people say, five slamma jamma. But the new kids, we got that burner. In this game, I had the third, no Steph Curry. And it couldn't came any sooner. After coming off a disappointing first game, we had to bounce back in a big way. What more can I say? The three ball always saves the day.